What is going on everybody? Welcome back to a, another YouTube video by yours truly, Chef Boyar, Coach Kev. Now in today's video, we are making high protein ice cream. Now at first, I know what you're thinking. Is it gonna taste like Halo Top? Is it gonna taste like Enlightened? Absolutely not. This tastes actually very good. Um, I'm not a big sweets person. I'm not even a big ice cream person, but I know I needed something that was kind of a dessert to kind of help me through my prep. Um, if you don't know, I am currently in a bodybuilding prep, getting ready for a bodybuilding show this year, coming in hopefully August is the goal. Um, but my coach is planning to just kind of go day by day, see what I look like um, as we get closer to August. Um, so it really depends. So to kind of help me get through the days, I try to find different recipes that are very filling, very tasty, because very soon as we get closer to prep, I'm gonna have to start eating very boring and bland foods just so that way I can kind of cut down on cravings. But for now, since I can still have very you know interesting, uh, tasty food, I'm gonna try my best to put out tons of different recipes for you guys so you guys can see the different type of variety of foods I try to eat throughout the weekend. Um, mostly because I eat the same thing throughout the week. On the weekends or my days off, I'll usually um, try different things, try new recipes. Um, so yeah, what we'll be making today is the high protein ice cream. I will be using a Ninja blender. Now I've had the recipe about three times prior to this video and it's been amazing. It tastes very filling, it tastes great, um, and it definitely will knock you out for a while. I mean, I had this thing, one day before a workout and I had to lay down and say, okay, maybe I'll work out in an hour instead of in 30 minutes because I was full, I was done. I, so it's definitely a great recipe to have um, at the end of the day. I don't know if I'd have it in the beginning just because you don't want to be too full before the rest of your day. Um, so yeah, I hope that this is uh, enjoyment for you guys. So let's go straight into the kitchen and let's get started. Let go. All right guys, so now that we're in the kitchen, I'm gonna show you all the different ingredients we'll be using for today. At the bottom in the description, I'll leave the serving sizes, the total calories, all that good stuff, and the exact brand that I'll be using in today's video if you don't get a uh, quick enough glance when I show it on the screen. All right, so first thing we're using today is chocolate casein protein. We're gonna use blackberries, sugar-free jello, xanthan gum, Splenda, and lastly, some almond milk. All right, so now that we got all the ingredients ready, let's go ahead and prep them up and throw them into the blender. Lego. All right, so right here in front of me, I have all of my powders together. I have the xanthan gum, the Splenda, and the Jello in here. So I have seven grams of the not the Jello, the uh, the pudding mix, the vanilla pudding mix. I have five grams of the xanthan gum, and I have five grams of the Splenda. Over here, we have 72 grams of blackberries. We have four ounces of almond milk, and then we're going to do two scoops of the casein protein. All right, and so right before we start blending, we go ahead and fill up this whole bowl with about ice. Um, I don't really ever measure the ice, I just kind of play it by ear. So this bowl is yay big. So I'm just gonna fill it up with some ice and throw it in there. guys the protein ice cream is all done and look at how thick I mean this thing is thick look at that all right guys the ice cream is finally done we're sitting back we're gonna try it out now I'm gonna let you guys know how it tastes whoa I mean look at this thing look how look how much there is I mean it's crazy honestly all right guys there's no way i'm gonna be able to finish all that right now i'll have to sit that down for a little bit and just kind of nibble on that for a while i like the pizza i was able to crash that thing quick the the ice cream is definitely something i'm about to sit down and enjoy and maybe watch a good movie with watch some tv or even get some work done do some studying um, but aside from that let me go and show you guys the amount of calories it has i mean this is only if it focuses this is only 274 calories. 274 calories for this whole thing. I've been nibbling on it for a while now. Still got a good bit to go. I was planning on working out in like 20 minutes, but it looks like I went to push that for about another hour. I mean, this thing is filling. I mean, me, I love to eat. I love to eat high volume food because it makes me feel really good. I mean, this thing is high volume times 10. I mean, I don't even think Goku himself could finish this in one sitting. He may be able to because he's Goku, but me, not a saint. 
But anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. I'm gonna try and wrap this up, try and finish this uh, protein ice cream in the next maybe 30 minutes, hopefully, so I can work out in about an hour and 30 minutes. Probably get some reading done. I'm currently reading. For fun, I'm reading Batman Hush. For better mindsets, I'm reading Talking to Strangers. And to increase my knowledge when it comes to fitness, I am reading The RP Diet once again. I try to read this thing over and over again just so I make sure everything I get. This will technically be my third full time reading it. I've read through it once without any notes. I went back a second time, wrote a few notes, but now this time I'm gonna go back. I'm only in a few pages and as you can tell, this time I'm going through, I'm writing notes on almost every page, things I've maybe not caught the first or second time that we can really sink in and make sure that I know as much about nutrition as possible to continue to help you guys out there um, knowing what to do. So if you guys did enjoy the video and you would like to see more recipes, go ahead, like, subscribe, share, and leave comments below to let me know what kind of recipes you'd like to see in the future. And I will see you guys next time.